European paper wasps are an introduced species, unlike our dark, either brown or black, native paper wasps. These guys look basically like striped uh, long legged yellow jackets. Um, they have a competitive advantage because they start building earlier than ours and thus build up their numbers faster. And so they will outcompete our native paper wasps. Also, since many of the caterpillars and other animals that they eat did not evolve with them, that means that they don't have good evolutionary tactics to deal with this new predator. And they can eliminate a lot, especially the caterpillars, within a certain area, bringing them back to feed to their young. They're called paper wasps, like all paper wasps. Polistes is the genus because they chew, masticate leaf and bark and make these paper nests. But unlike hornets, which are big ball-shaped self-contained things, these things hang almost umbrella-like from an upper surface. They can get fairly aggressive, but again, these are European paper wasps, an introduced species, which people are really worried about is outcompeting our native paper wasps and um, killing basically a lot of the animals around them. And it's got to do with them coming out earlier. It's got to do with them being having producing more young, and so being able to defend their nest against predators and I'll compete our native ones. And this area has one uh, paper wasp nest from last year. Here's one from this year. I'm gonna try to flan over because I don't know if you can see it, but here's one queen actually building a brand new one here. You can see her actually starting to build this particular nest. This is a brand new queen building a paper wasp nest, European paper wasp. You can see how long the legs are and they can be fairly aggressive too. European paper wasps, an introduced species, they're probably, um, is, is causing issues with our native wildlife and competing with our native paper wasp species.